be there because the last event was amazing. We were 8,000 people. Everybody was so happy. Everybody were so pumped up to build Crowd1. And maybe that's why South Africa was and is still the biggest continent in the Crowd1 land. And um, if you don't get tickets for the, um, for the event, there is still tickets for the white party. I think the after party is going to be one of the coolest parties ever. And uh, it also gives you an opportunity to, to meet up with, uh, with the top people, the management and the other people and have more private one-to-one -one talk. And of course, when you are in the queue and remember, Crowd1 has rented that um, uh, water park itself. And as we are, we are always the biggest customer wherever we go. And uh, we're going to have uh, so many people that's going to come. And before the event, the day before, as you know, we have the mega training. And uh, these trainings, if you are from manager and director, the presidents are full. Those rooms are completely full. But when it comes to director, please make sure if you're a director, if you have the rank of director, be there. It's going to be exactly up to you but if you're a director and you get that kind of training you can expect that you're going to be on the stage 2020 as one of the next president so this is not just a ticket to to success this is a, a recipe so, for success and i've been working with peter jacobson now for soon 20 years and um, when i came into the business he was already a legend and uh, when he is out there and teaching his principles, that's exactly what works. And even if you're into online marketing, everything is related to relationships. And when it comes to building relation in combination with online marketing and affiliate marketing, Peter Jacobson is the number one. So if you get the ingredients and if you have a funnel or you have a pipeline or whatever you have, once you have the system and follow Peter's part when it comes to setting goals building relations working in the way of moving the team forward that's how you can build this big and i don't think it would be possible what crowd one has done impossible is nothing to be this huge amount of people that we have gathered already if it wasn't for the principles i'm always building after them and that's why we have the biggest team and the biggest group in crowd one and we are one family it's one team out there, but with duplication, following a system and taking place there. So make sure that you go in now, buy the last tickets. If you have friends to come, make sure that they come. Make sure that you have signed up for the training. Manager and, and directors, there's still places to go. And uh, if you're hungry out there, don't hesitate. If you have a person who is close to be there, make sure that you do it. Even if you qualify the same day, just make it and be sure that you have a seat. Last time we had meetings in uh, both in Manila, it was so full. We had to let people outside the room. I don't want to uh, let you be outside this time. So that's why there's going to be three different trainings, managers, directors and presidents. And you can imagine if you go on the president training in the future, that's the reason why presidents are presidents. And um, with that one, I think that we're going to have very soon Mr. Peter coming in. Make sure that you call your friends and make sure that they are on these trainings. Every Sunday, we have the Sunday school. And um, take notes. Make sure that you get all the information. Peter is going to always give you some kind of advices. Whether you've been in the industry for 20 years, 30 years, or this is your first network you will get some advices that is valuable. And there's a reason why Peter built a million people, helped me to build more than two million people and, and other people to be mega successful in the network industry. So it's a pleasure to have Peter Jacobson on the call as always. And uh, we are ready with pen and paper and our brains are on, on and uh, ears are all yours. So, Mr. Peter Jacobson, are you ready? Thank you, Bjorn. Yeah, I'm ready. Welcome, everybody, to Sunday School. And wherever you are in the world, it's maybe it's morning, like for me, it's early morning. Uh, maybe it's afternoon. Maybe it's nighttime. 
who knows because we're so big now so the crowd is growing everywhere you know everywhere but there's a lot still to go you know there's a lot still of stuff to do so that's why we keep on we keep on we have we have a system and um if you're new to this webinar today uh maybe you've never been here before or you're an upcoming leader because this is uh, a webinar it's hard you know when you have an online marketing system there's so many people getting on board so it's hard to keep up and have control and that's why we have these webinars because we're growing so fast we're growing so fast uh, and uh, like i said it's hard to have control for you as a leader but it's also for us because it's we're growing like crazy and there's people everywhere but these webinars is conducted in a way so you can always get something out of it it doesn't matter if you're you know, you're a professional top leader you know everything you're the superstar or you just started and that's the whole purpose of these webinars is to get some uh, someone uh, out there some information that you can use you know motivation is the spark that light the fire of knowledge uh, it's so true because we all need motivation and like Bjorn said um, if you're on these webinars on Sundays have a pen and a piece of paper so you can take notes maybe you you get some uh, information maybe you you hear something that you said wow you know that i'm going to use i'm going to use that thing you know everything else was was not super good but i didn't like it whatever i learned something from my mentor many many years ago that is we humans we don't get everything we can't our brain can't uh, consume you know information so a good advice is to pick up the gold pieces you know there's the bits there's like gold nuggets there's gold nuggets everywhere there's gold nuggets in books there's gold nuggets in in events there's gold nuggets at this webinar there's something that you can pick up and you can move with you know why do we why do we have leadership at all you know we can we can go to the first slide and see what the first slide says here so we're in a business we're in a business where we grow, you know, people are astounding. You know, now network marketing, direct direct sales, or online marketing, you know, we're we're in, we're using the same principle. That is the law of multiplication. And people have starting to get it, you know, lately. I mean, I remember many years ago when I was uh, you know, not a pioneer, but this business was not as as uh, common for people as it is today today most people heard about it most people know about it but still uh, people are amazed that's why they try to copy that's why many companies are trying to use um a network marketing or you know the law of multiplication as a model to to reach people in in business then that's why we are so powerful you know if you get this system if you get what 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 um crowd one is doing we are building a crowd you know that we don't own any gambling companies we affiliate we have affiliates but we we are we have a crowd that's what we're building and when we add on all these companies uh to the crowd that's when we make money so we're a powerful powerful machine in itself through the law of multiplication and so concentrate don't focus so much on what's going on we have professionals taking care of everything out there so focus on building the crowd because and since since the law of multiplication works that's why it's going so fast and sometimes it's maybe going too fast so people can't keep up but listen guys uh, the low multi the low multiplication is going to make some people uh make some serious money maybe they they have not the knowledge to build uh, uh or contain or you know keep the team moving 
but you got to realize the law of multiplication is working and we're using it so let's go to the next slide see what we have here so we're building we're building a crowd you are in this crowd you are a part of this crowd you have your team and everyone has their own team you know there's there's a lot of wrong sayings in this industry you know that oh you know i work uh, under him or i work for him no everyone's working for themselves everybody's building their own team but you are part of another team that means you have a chain of command that means that you know um, you are connected someone show you this business someone someone is your sponsor and of course you know we don't we are not forced to work with with uh, uh, even though we got signed up with someone you know it's our it's our right to do whatever we want to do but it's to be part of a team because team makes the difference and you can see that you know uh, look at Bjorn um, when he started in in the crowd one why he's so successful is he started to building a team with principles with rules you know take this take this down you know every relationship have rules it doesn't matter where you ever you go every relationships have rules you know uh, maybe you have your relationships in at workplace or maybe you at, at home in your family you know everywhere you go you have rules and so do we we have rules here too it's not that we have written them down in a book but we bring them up on on trainings and we bring them up uh, on on these webinars and people are doing it you know on, on the field out in the field you know when they're working but every relationship have rules that means that you know, if if we stay together, we will be stronger. It's like everywhere. You know, if you split people up in small groups, uh, and you know, sometimes people think that, oh, you know, I'm gonna do this on my own. But then, you know, someday you need your upline, or you need your sponsor, or you need your information uh, coming down. So, please, please, uh, you know. From the bottom of my heart, it's stronger to stay together. It's powerful to stay together also. But you are building your team. You're responsible for your team. And, you know, leadership, why do we have these leadership trainings? Well, because, number one, not all of us have been in business before. You know, so we need some training. But it's better to have no training than the wrong training that's also so important why you need to stay put stay close to the people who have the knowledge stay close to the people who have the information because it's going so fast in online marketing and it's hard to keep up sometimes that's why we need to be really cautious with that and you know why we why we have these these webinars for leaders is that leadership you know leaders leadership is the the essence of all success leadership has has um without leadership there's nothing you know i mean everyone has worth but not everyone has value how do i get valuable well when you're building this business you maybe you know a little bit or you know a lot doesn't matter when you're building yourself, when you're doing the right things, when you're doing and following the principles, and it's come from the same source, the principles are the same. You know, principles never change. And you're building yourself. You're you're um, you're reading and you're you're taking part of trainings and and you you get yourself motivated because leaders are self motivated. Leaders don't need anyone to motivate them, but still they can get motivated by going to to events and you know seminars and everything. Because everyone, it's the same with me, you know, uh, I get amazed still after all these years that I can still get that spark. You know, that I can I listen to some 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 uh, people that I have uh, trust in 
that are actually people who build leadership. I, for many years, I listened to Miles Monroe and actually uh, was mentored a little bit by him. And, you know, he gets me going, really. Okay, so your team is important, you know, because um, in, a, in a way, when we have this business, we are bringing so many average people on board. And people think that success because they have a mindset that is wrong. That's what, you know, that's where everything goes wrong. People have a mindset that is wrong because they're, they're set up on a wrong thinking. They come from a background, you know, family or work or, you know, even in the country, it could be wrong thinking. And they come into this industry and they actually get some training where they can use these principles for the rest of their life. That's why this is a beautiful business because we get so much extra, you know, we get some extra, you know, the, the things we get uh, that we can use that no one can take away from you. And, you know, money will always follow solutions and leaders are solutions oriented. Leaders don't dwell upon problems because they know, a real leader know that problems, negativity will never take anyone you no know, nowhere will go nowhere and you know it's the it's the it's your belief system that will determine your philosophy that's why we have these webinars and trainings and and you will see you will see that most um uh, not everyone out there that have written a book about you know uh, self-help or you know leadership is good reading because some people they write a book because they self read a book then they write a book about the book they were reading so they don't have the real empiric knowledge and knowledge means that you've done it you've been on the field you know how it works you have a knowledge of people skills you know stuff and no one can take that away from you. So everyone has a worth, but not everyone has value. Remember that you need to increase your thinking, increase so you get more valuable because that's when you get paid more. Okay, let's go to the next slide. Let's see what we have. So yeah, when you build in your team, without you knowing it you are creating a culture there's there's no way around it you will have a either a bad or a good culture there's no way around it and the culture will create the results so listen guys if you do, if you've been in here for a while or it doesn't really matter it's never too late to get started make sure you have the right culture because we don't need Pro more problems than than we already have you know the world is full of stuff that we're going to solve so creating a culture means when you start this business you lead by example you know there's certain rules that we don't cross ever in this industry that is like stealing others people or cross-line recruiting it's called that's not allowed in any company not even it's not allowed here and, you know, bad mouthing someone, you know, it's not going to take you any way further using those traps. It's just a trap to, to, for everyone to just, you know, get into more problems. So, but I know most people out there, we, we have a good crowd. I'm not, you know, bashing on you. I'm just letting you know that, that it could happen. And then that's where leadership shows. That's when leadership shows. That's when some leader steps up and say, hey, guys, stop it. You know, it's enough. Okay. So your belief system will determine your philosophy. That means that, uh, I, like I said before, when, when, uh, when this business is going so fast, it's better to have no training than the wrong training. Because the, the wrong training is like, you know, the oil tanker. You heard that example, you know, an oil tanker steer his, the captain on board steer his ship, you know, by, you know, uh, um, like a hundred of a millimeter uh, on, on his course will change the course on the ship, maybe 10, 15, 25 
250 kilometers uh, in the end. And that's the same thing here. When we doing a little bit wrong in the beginning, we will get the crowd or we will get the culture wrong and our team will go a little bit astray, a little bit in the wrong direction. And when you build your team, listen guys, when you have when you have people, you involve people, everyone will not become a leader. That's that's just the way it is. That's you know I mean I I would love for everyone to become a leader. But there's always people out there who are more coachable, they're teachable. And that for me has always been number one, number one essence, equality in, in a person that he is coachable, he's teachable, he's listening. Because if you have people that have egos, you know, ego doesn't take you anywhere. People, people think, but they will, it will not, you know, in the end, you can make money, it can still be an idiot. It doesn't matter. Money won't change you. The things that will change you is the principles. If you put them in work with your team and yourself and you start learning, you know, that uh, one day, one day you maybe have use for this stuff. So, you know, nurture, it means feed. You got to nurture yourself, but you got to nurture your organization. You know, we have that saying leaders are readers, leaders are feeders, leaders are seeders. Leaders feed their organization with good, positive stuff, you know, uh, energy, inspiration, but also some sense of some common sense and knowledge and make them. Uh, stick together, make them realize that, you know, together we achieve more. And team, you know, is is team spirit. If you have, let's say you have five leaders, 10 leaders, 20 leaders, and they're all coachable, and you together build a machine that is unstoppable, you know, this that's unstoppable spirit. So become a person of value. Because, you know, um, ideas, it's not, you know, money does not attract money. Ideas attract money. That's why this company is so successful. Because the founder, Jonas, and the guys uh, who were behind this company, they had ideas that were revolutionized this business. And you never know when you start something if it's going to succeed or not. But we had a perfect combination. Uh, <clears throat> you know, we we were thinking, and I had a little tiny bit part of this. I will not take credit, but I know that when you combine the the internet, that's the fast business that we're in today, the um, online marketing, with some old good principles business principles and you know um, old style that's why we are so successful because most companies who are growing this fast they go up and then they go down and then disappear and we will not because we have a foundation we want to bring l real leadership to you guys and some 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 stuff you maybe you don't like maybe you say oh what is this you know that's fine that's okay you don't have to like everything, but there's always something that, you know, that you can learn or you can write down. You know, uh, it's so true. You know, uh, a flock of sheep led by a lion will always conquer a flock of lions led by a sheep. That's why leadership is so important, because a leader, he launch out and he take action. And it doesn't matter what's going on. A leader lead and the leader lead by example. So that's the culture, guys. Let's see what we have here on on next slide. So we have this, you know, we talk about attitude. Why do we do that? Why do every business talk about attitude? Because attitude is the essence for success. And it's so beautiful that, you know, attitude you can change in a second by your thinking that's why attitude is important because it's changeable you can you know william james 
he said the most uh, the biggest um, uh, invention in mankind was that when we realized that we can change our attitude and when we change our attitude we change our life so attitude is so important because attitude actually comes from your belief system so your belief system will change your attitude but you can change your attitude day by day just by listening to some good uh, material you know some read the book or you know go online listen to some youtube videos and something you get some ideas but in the end you got to have a sustainable attitude that means you have to change your belief system that's why the abcs you know attitude belief and commitment is so important because believe belief system changing the attitude but what changing your belief system is your commitment you know when you're committed you don't have to know anything you can just say aye aye sir i'm ready to do whatever you tell me to do that's the spirit and i was taught by the best in this industry I, my first mentor in this business he had tough love and i'm so grateful for that then later when i moved on and i learned by the best in the industry the people who made already millions i could see a red thread i could see a pattern i could see a pattern how successful people moved they were doing the same thing it wasn't wasn't any different it wasn't that they had a magic formula or you know, I, I wish there would be one no i do wouldn't but i mean there's no magic formula for success there's just basic principles so commitment change your belief system because when you're committed you're committed and when you when you have a belief system your attitude's starting to change okay guys so we we will start to help you change your belief system we will we already started we've been doing this for almost a year now and um, we have these events we have these webinars but the events are important because that's where people get the the big picture and like Bjorn said maybe that's why it's just taking off because so many people came to the South African event, the first one, and they flew in from Nigeria, Kenya, you know, Zambia, Mozambique, you know, all over, just to be part of that event. <clears throat> so event is important. Event is actually, in my mind, I think, if it's big or smaller, it doesn't matter. It's 80% of our industry, of our business. It's going fast. You can recruit online, but if you want to, if you want to have a sustainable business, if you want to have true leadership, where you move, you move this from continent to continent. You know, leaders give people meaning. That's why we have leadership. You know, leaders give people a meaning, so they know that they have some someone to follow. And you know. In the end, you were born to lead. You were born, you're designed to lead. Whatever ever, you know, anyone have told you before, it's not true. I can tell you, you were born, you came here winning. You were born to lead. It's just a matter of getting some information. You can't take a shortcut. There's no way, there's no elevator to success. You gotta take the steps. And the steps is, you know, the same for everyone. You start learning, you start changing your attitude, you start learning about stuff, you know, pe people skills, you, you start to be humble, you're a humble person, you know, that, you know, uh, you have wisdom, you start getting wisdom after a couple, you know, 10, 15, 20 years, whatever, that's how it works. And then you, no one can take that away from you, you're unstoppable. And that's why I love this industry because we can give people so much. We can not only give them money, but we can also give them knowledge. And that's the most important thing because money can disappear in a second. Knowledge is there forever. And when you got it once, no one can take that away from you. You can start doing anything you want to do when you have these principles. Okay, guys, next webinar is um let me see maybe we're not doing one next sunday because
that's when uh, we have um, uh let me see saturday and the party. yeah maybe we do one next sunday so if there's a link sent out uh you know there's going to be one otherwise i see you guys the next sunday after that okay guys crowders you are awesome and you're doing an amazing work out there all the real leaders so stick together you know <clears throat> be positive be humble and know that you are born to win thank you <laughs>